What's up, guys? Uh, I was watching this uh, edit, uh, and I find it really, really disturbing. And uh, obviously, I, I couldn't even finish it until the end, until now. Uh, this guy's basically talking about Christianity and how Christianity is not doing so good right now uh, with the rise of Islam. Uh, and this just turns my gears. It makes my blood boil because Christianity has always been the dominant religion for like the, the last 70 to 100 years, right? And now that Islam is trending, this guy's crying. Islam is trending because Islam is the truth and Christianity makes no sense. And this guy is so passive aggressive about it. And He's basically uh, blaming Muslims for what's happening to Christianity. It's not Muslims' fault that you don't practice your own religion, you stupid dork. What are you even doing? This whole video doesn't make any sense. It, all it is is just roasting a bunch of Muslims. Like, how does this convey anything about Christianity whatsoever? And then you see the comments, Oh, Jesus is on our side. It's so disgusting. Uh, it's, it, this, is, this isn't even about Christianity. This is literally about Western culture. That's what this whole video is. And it's so funny how this guy has to actually use music to convey an emotional message. Because he can't actually con convey an emotional message without any fucking music. It's just so sad. It's so disgusting, the hypocrisy in this video. Let's not dare say gun. Like modern modern day Christians are a joke. <laughs> they are literally a joke, man. Men have and, and you can you can clip this and use it in your next little uh, dark edit if you like. I don't care. You're disgusting. If I can spit across my screen, it would reach you. I would. Formed a church, killing at least fifty worshippers and wounding many others. On the day of judgment, even Jesus Christ. So he's he's literally bashing Islam. Okay, he's literally, he's literally bashing Islam here. He's putting a bunch of clips from Muslims. What does this have to do with Christianity whatsoever? <laughs> like, what? Muslims get... Muslims, oh my god. Do you know what Muslims have to go through compared to Christians? Like, North America is literally Christian-dominated. It's Christian-dominated, and a lot of a uh, areas, especially where I live, are Asian-dominated. If you're Asian and you're Christian, you have, like, a free pass to whatever you want here. Christians dominate this whole... They get a slap on the wrist for whatever they do. It's complete. This whole video is completely BS. What are you crying about, you emotional little fuck? Cannot save us. Only was Jesus. Yeah, Jesus can't sh save us on the day of judgment. It is like what? What does that have to do with Christianity? <laughs> what? Okay, well, was Jesus gay? I mean, that's an offense to Muslims as well, right? Like, obviously, we don't we don't c condone this at all. Muslims have stood up against this kind of weird stuff online ever since the beginning of the internet. So, <laughs> I don't know what... This Unlike you guys, you don't even stand up for this. You guys just accept everything, right? Maybe this, this is a video of, like, accepting everything. I don't even know what the whole point of this video is. It's so emotional in all the wrong ways. It makes no sense. <laughs> This, this video has literally no purpose and it's gotten so much reaction from a bunch of shallow Christians because all they do is listen to music all day and follow blind faith. Just a reminder that Christianity is a white supremacist cult and that your sincerely held beliefs are actually a mental illness caused by generational abuse. Christian, modern day Christianity and white supremacy do go hand in hand. That's actually kind of true from my perspective. I can only speak from my own perspective from where I live. Oh, again, again, more, more Arabic and Muslim. Okay, these are not Arabs, by the way. These are by no means Arabs. If they were Arabs, <laughs> they'd probably be stoned to death. But I don't know what these are. I don't know. I, again, this doesn't do anything for Christianity. What the heck? <laughs> that that looks really disgusting. Like I'm I'm fasting, and I see that, and my soul wants to escape my body. Imagine seeing your husband. He puts his headphones in. He puts his headphones in. It's like a good little Christian listening to music. It's been brother or uh, and then there it is. ISIS clips. ISIS clips. Okay. <laughs> Father. Oh my god. This just turns my gears, man. The Christians have done way worse to Muslims throughout the years. And we don't even know if ISIS actually stands for Islam. Like, it's just a bunch of people in masks. Brutally killed. That's what happened to many families. Like, have you seen what the Crusaders did to the Palestinians and the Muslims? Have you seen the thousands, the millions that they've killed? Have you seen what the U.S. president has done to a lot of Arabic and Muslim countries? Have you seen the amount of oil that you guys have been stealing from us? Like, the only reason your country's thriving is because you guys keep stealing from us. Now, is it fair for me to blame all Christians? 
Like, why, I should be making a video, not the other way around. Like, you're so delusional. It's when ISIS executed... Look at this dumb... Oh, I don't want to insult her while fasting. This is your fucking Western media. How come they never talk about the truth? They all talk about the shallow stuff. You don't even talk about 1% of the shit Christians do. You're an idiot. You're a buffoon. Look at this woman. Look at her. She looks like she's... Oh my god, you are... She... <laughs> oh, I'm, I'm trying so hard not to insult her while fasting, but you, this just makes my blood boil. You're disgusting for making this video. You're a disgrace. As a white man's religion. That's what it's turned into. It's turned... Christianity is literally a political movement. You guys don't even practice it. Reject modern... <laughs> Oh my god! Christi modern day Christianity is what created modernity. What What are you saying? Oh my god, is this like a high school project? What? And then there are these weird pictures of Jesus, which don't quite frankly make any sense because you don't even know what he actually looked like. And he certainly wasn't white. Like, <laughs> what the actual? What is this? It's like the ultimate disrespect to even paint a picture of Jesus. And here you are with a bunch of disgusting pictures and they don't look anything like Jesus. Like, oh my god, what is this? Look, what is this? I think, like, are, are, are these even human beings in the comments? We have Christ on our side. <laughs> what? What? And our greatness will be achieved with cr Oh my god. Jesus yes, Christ is my savior. I don't believe in all spirits and- That's what all Christians say. They all say the same thing. They're like robots. It's blind faith. It's completely blind. What? Oh, oh I, well, I'm sick. I don't even know if I can actually make it to the end of this video. I'm so emotionally disturbed watching this. And even- Like- Oh my god, this used to be one of my favorite songs, and you butchered it. <laughs> Mentioning stuff like that on TV, you're getting it. And the, and you can know it all you want, but until you got to pick up that cross that you can't carry, and he picks it up for you and carries you and the cross, then you know. There is God, you know, there is God that who can raise someone from nothing into something. As Jesus is the name of the Lord. Ladies and gentlemen, thank you so much. God bless. That no one has the right to harass my faith. That's right. No one has the right to slander That's my right. faith. Christians, Orthodox Christians, Catholic Christians, Protestant Christians. Nobody's, nobody's fucking, nobody's slandering Christianity. Like, challenging an idea and slandering it are completely two different things. Demand that their faith. Do you, do you face any discrimination for being a Christian in North America? Have you have you faced any discrimination whatsoever for being a Christian in North America? Have you have you faced an ounce of discrimination compared to the Muslims? Uh, fa the discrimination Muslims face in North America. Yeah, yeah, you've barely faced any discrimination. Like I don't know what the point of this video is. Again, faith is respected. Put anything down. You cannot. All they do is preach, preach, preach. There's no actual facts. There's no actual backbone to anything they're saying. And everything they preach changes and changes and changes as time goes on. And this isn't slander. This isn't slander. This is literally what's happening. Your religion was in Aramaic, translated to Greek, translated to English. Is that slander? No, everything people are saying they're challenging your religion and there's nothing you do about it you just keep getting emotional oh, certainly and then you play emotional songs like this time and our nation to change our words and let's begin now to use the word up up from all of this filth up from this violence up from this indifference of courts up up to the hit battlements of eternity up up to god Again, like, I don't even know what that means. You were lost. Uh, I don't feel lost. You are lost and you're projecting. The only way you could possibly know what it's like to be lost is if you are actually lost. And you are lost and you're still lost. That's why you claim others are lost. You can't possibly know what the meaning of life is if you have none.
what you found is modern day contentment and what you found is a community filled with lies and you th you found peace in that but it's just temporary and if you dig deeper into your own religion you eventually will leave it because it makes no sense and it's filled with contradictions which is why it's on the downfall right now Again, you completely butchered this song for me for life. Like, I don't even think I'm gonna be listening to this song ever again. And don't get the wrong idea, I don't hate Christians. I just hate what Christianity has become. I hate modern day Christianity. Like, I'm an Arab, obviously, and I'm a Palestinian, and there's a lot of Palestinians who are Christian. So I don't hate Christians, I just hate this whole victim mindset. Actually, I don't even know if I hate Christianity or not, I'm gonna be honest. I, it'd be a lot, I, I don't know. I was lost. Christ is calling me, it doesn't make any sense. What I mean by, well, I don't know. I don't know. Well, I already said what I had to say about this video, but what I hate about Christianity the most from my experience so far is how Christians hate to be challenged on their ideals and their views. Um, I can respect Orthodox Christianity. That's the part of Christianity where I will actually respect because they haven't really changed much of Christianity or they've tried their hardest to preserve Christianity. But I can't accept modern day Christianity. I can't accept what Christianity has turned into. It makes very little sense. And I just get so angry when Christians keep defending their religion with... Oh, and now people will, will clip this. Now people will clip it and say, Oh, you'll get angry at people defending their religion. I know this is probably going to get clipped. But I get so angry when people uh, defend their religion with emotion rather than facts. And they just use the media to manipulate people with a bunch of songs that are completely emotional. Like, man, what did I just witness? I just felt so at peace. And then I watched that and then my brain just went like, what? <laughs> like, that was so weird. That's so, I don't even know, man. I guess the best way to describe the video that I just watched is ironic.